Hey, greetings. It's Tuesday, so um, Mars Day. This is Dharma of Dharma Geddon Well. And uh, it being Tuesday and Mars Day, I picked some nettles today. I've been picking a lot because it's spring and I really love them. I have them in my smoothies every morning because they're delicious and it makes me feel good. And uh, today I had some surprise company and kind of out of a lot of groceries. So I'm like, hmm, what can I make with the things that I have here? Okay, I'm going to make a nettle curry and then I added some cashews for protein but also when I picked the nettles and the last several times I picked the nettles I'm like huh there's a lot of stuff on these is this bugs kind of looks like aphids well whatever I'm just gonna eat it because you know I, I freeze them and put them in my smoothie and just bigger extra protein and then you know I picked a lot for the curry tonight and I was thinking lots of extra protein and that's good because it's a vegetarian meal and so maybe the guys will appreciate that so anyway I let him know that that was a thing and my roommate Sean you know he saw them crawling in the sink as well and you know they were crawling on my hands they were a lot um but you know everything must go in the curry or in the smoothie and I figured it's probably just extra healthy so then I was joking around about it but kind of not joking because I had this really good feeling about aphids so I was like, hey, Chattis Kedab, look up aphids, see what kind of nutritional value they have. But he wasn't super successful when talking to Siri. So then I went ahead and did a search and wouldn't you just know it, let me um, share this information with you from an article by the Naked Scientist entitled, Could Aphid Farms Be the Answer to World Hunger? Well, clearly they wouldn't have written this article if there wasn't something about it that means that they could. So let me read you just this little excerpt here. Um, an overlooked source of protein, carbs, and amino acids, aphids, or plant lice. I did not know that aphids were called plant lice. That didn't make me feel better, but the rest of it did. Again, overlooked source of protein, carbs, and amino acids, aphids, or plant lice, are a potentially unparalleled food source. It was once said that if the offspring of one female aphid survived the summer, there would be enough aphids to stand in military formation, circumferencing this planet several times. That's right. It's whatever million comes after quadrillion. Now, the beautiful part is that they not only feed on plants, but there is a type of aphid for literally every plant on Earth. Currently, the only breed available to order online are pea aphids, which eat a variety of plants, most of which are very quick germinators and reach maturity in at most two months. Imagine we could create a sustainable ecosystem, growing our quadrillion aphids, requiring only sunlight, water, and backup plants. Simply knock off some aphids when your rice needs some protein because the little green guys reach maturity in a week, producing about 50 to 100 eggs when they do. And for parts of the year, they reproduce asexually, making the management of their population even easier. Additionally, there's an aphid breed for just about every plant in the world, meaning we could pick the best pair for the production of organic matter. So anyway, it goes on about the different kinds of aphids and how they could be bred. But um, the other thing I noticed is my nettles are in great shape. So they're covered with aphids but the aphids don't seem to be hurting them and they're just adding protein to my meal. So I feel very excited to have learned this about um, aphids. I still don't want them eating my plum tree or some of my other plants, but I guess they're welcome to hang out and be in a positive symbiotic relationship with my nettles and, and then I get to join with them too. So this is something I learned today, again, Tuesday, Mars Day, nettles being under the planetary rulership of Mars. Um, delicious, stinging, and in this case, covered with extra protein in the form of aphids. Live and learn. Ooh.